Hello guys, it's Mr. Majestic here to show you guys how to make a RAM disk. Doing this will make your Minecraft speed up a lot. Just to give you guys a quick idea, my laptop used to be getting around 35 to 40 FPS. But after I set up a RAM disk, I was getting anywhere up to 120 to 130. So it has a huge difference in reality. And I'll show you how that's done. First off, you want to get a program called RAM Disk. Click this link, download the freeware version, install it, and then you should get one of these icons. Open it up, it'll take a moment. and you'll get this kind of screen first of all what you want to do is you want to check unformatted partition here for your size of ram disk what this does effectively is takes your ram and makes a virtual hard drive out of it so now I know for a fact that my Minecraft at any stage is around 250 megabytes. Of course, world saves can get quite big. So if you can, if you can spare that extra RAM, it's always good to. I wouldn't recommend a RAM disk more than two gigabytes just because the loading and saving time of the RAM disk can get quite long. So if you got about four gig of RAM on your computer, you wouldn't want to really be pushing over even 500 megabytes. Of course, if you don't have many like world saves and all that, then you can even go down to about 350 and save that extra RAM on your computer to allocate to Minecraft otherwise. So for now, we'll use 500 megabytes, unformatted partition. You don't have to really worry about that at the moment. Load and save. Now your RAM disk file will save to this location. Here you got load disk image at startup. Every time you turn off your computer, your RAM disk will save. Or every time you stop RAM disk, it will save. This is very important because if your computer crashes with the RAM disk running, there's a very good chance that your whole RAM disk will get wiped. So if you do use a RAM disk, it's always smart to have just a backup of your saves, backup of anything important in another folder on your hard drive. If you load disk image at startup, this will slow down your, your boot time so what I personally do, I just leave that unchecked, open RAM disk and start RAM disk every time I want to play Minecraft, as in when I turn on the computer. So we'll leave that unchecked. You can check it if you want. It's no big deal. Event log, that's not important. And here I do do not start RAM disk when Windows starts because I like to have a fast boot up. And yeah, so all you have to do now is go start. RAM disk has started successfully. Now what you want to do is you want to go, if you're running Windows 7, you can use a start bar. If you're running Windows 8 without a start bar, you would have to go to control panel. But I have Windows 8 with a start bar. So all you have to do is type partitions or there not even fully create and format hard disk partitions you want to open this up and it says you must initialize this disk so all you do just leave that master boot record and you'll see here 499 megabytes unallocated well this is our ram disk effectively what you want to do, you want to right click it, click new simple volume, click next, just leave that as is. 
assign a letter you know when you're in my computer and your hard drives have a letter like this all you have to do is choose one I generally use M like M for Minecraft but really do whatever suits you go next format the following allocation size just leave that NTFS is good here volume name the volume name is basically the local disk or data plus programs two terabytes it's basically that I generally call my one MC you know Minecraft oops click next click finish and now I just got this pop-up my computer MC that's the RAM disk so the RAM disk now is open however if you can't if you copy and paste all your Minecraft stuff into this it won't quite work yet you will have to create because the way Minecraft installs it goes to app data roaming and all that so to get to our Minecraft folder just cancel that you go app data percent and then you get your Minecraft folder this shouldn't really be here it's here because obviously I used Minecraft on this computer before so I'll just kind of move this out of the way somewhere one moment and ah uh, oh, it's a shortcut oh, that's a pain anyway we'll just delete that now what you want to do you want to open command prompt so you can just type in cmd cmd there we go and now you have to type in a little code we're going to basically link the minecraft folder that shows up here and make it link with the ram disk so to do that you type mk link space forward slash j app data percent backward slash dot minecraft and then your volume label so remember how we chose M well not label sorry our letter assigned letter I did M so for you this may be different just this one then go colon semicolon whatever they're called and a backward slash then hit enter beautiful junction created for this and as you can see it popped up right there which is spot on perfect so that was the code i will put that code in the or not code command i'll put that command in the description so that you guys can have it there and you won't have any problems but right now yeah you can see that happened and ram disk is still the same as you can see that's as it's supposed to be now if you run minecraft i don't think i'll be right back with the minecraft icon all right i'm back now we got the minecraft exe icon there so got that we can close that now all you have to do run minecraft and i will just log in mr major whoops tick and all right so i've logged in now we got obviously like profiles it should be on yeah 1.6.2 click play this will load up it's loading it's loading takes a little while because it's downloading everything to the directory and now we got it open 
So if we go to here, you'll see everything's in here. But not only that, if we go to users, majestic app data, roaming, Minecraft, it's also there. Everything that you put in either one of these folders will show up in both because this is a shortcut. So the real stuff is on the RAM disk. This is just a shortcut. And if we open this up and go single player, create a new world, new world, whatever. And let's see what kind of seed we get. Well, pretty average. Right now, if I switch back, yeah, far, I'm getting about 70 FPS, 80 FPS. I suppose that's pretty average. 92. Yeah, new world loading, all that. That is lower than I usually get, but as you can see, there is no lag, which is the important bit. And if, oh wait, no, that's smooth lighting, fast. Ah, oh, yes, max FPS, that's what we wanted. View bobbing, whatever, clouds, whatever. I usually have that to bright, server textures. And, um, Oh, there we go, there we go, yeah, max FPS fixed it up a bit. Now the FPS are getting upwards of 260. Of course I do have a really good computer, so that's why they're so high. But you should, you should at least get this smooth kind of gameplay if you run a RAM disk. And uh, yeah, I'll also show you guys how to allocate more RAM just quickly. In Magic Launcher, you can download Magic Launcher from like Minecraft forums or whatever. Ugh. You go, oh, it's so slow, what's going on? Oh, there we go. In Setup, you go Advanced, Memory, 512 meg is by default. Keep in mind your computer will need at least, I, th I would say, 2 gig of RAM just to be able to handle normal processes. If you got 500 meg on your RAM disk and you only got 4 gig of RAM total, maybe you'd allocate 1, 1.5 gig to Minecraft. And then, of course, you just hit OK, you log in, obviously. And, yeah, so when you're going to leave, I would stop RAM disk. It will stop the RAM disk device. One other thing, it may ask to install a driver when you're installing RAM disk. Just install that because it needs it to work. And yeah, so that's just about it. If this, well, it should work. So if it works for you, let me know. Leave some feedback if you're having any problems with it. Leave a comment below and I will try to help you. And yeah, sometimes it says it cannot be stopped. The reboot may be required. Don't panic by that. I will just turn off my computer normally and not worry about it. So yeah, don't worry about that. And I hope it helps. Take it easy, guys. See ya.